as you can see the mesh titan was able to grab 71 keywords okay while the keyword tool dominator was able to find 293 hey guys welcome back to my channel one of my subscribers asked me how to find new niches so this is what we're gonna do today if you go to our channel there is a playlist okay dedicated to merge by amazon for now i have uploaded 11 videos with a lot of information so um, i would suggest you please to go when you finish this video and check the 11 videos uh, there is a lot of good information in there for you guys first of all we have to understand that amazon does not know niches amazon only knows keywords and precisely keywords that the customer are typing in the search bar which is right there so basically to find other niches to find new niches we have to type in like we are a customer if i am a customer that like dogs i'm gonna type in certainly t-shirt for dog lovers and as you can see dog love t-shirt for dog lover here appear but instead of typing for each one of them t-shirt for dogs and so on what i can do is to type t-shirt for a and we can see here aunt art lover actor artist art and so on all of these here are niches okay but because i don't want to do it for each letter of the alphabet i'm gonna use a few tools the tool which is at right there which you give this expansion is the self-publishing titan it's a chrome extension you can download it and when you type in t-shirt for you're gonna see that you're gonna populate a bunch of keywords so what we're gonna do is to download all of them t-shirt for and i'm gonna download all the suggestion i save it here i'm gonna call it t-shirt titans okay and i'm gonna go to the other tool that we all know for those that are following me is the keyword tool dominator and again here i'm gonna type in t-shirt for and add the stars at the end and add the star at the end and click on search then i have other keywords here that i'm gonna again export okay i click on download selected keywords so now i have my two list of keywords the first list is from keyword tool dominator and the second one is from mesh titan as you can see the mesh titan was able to grab 71 keywords okay while the keyword tool dominator was able to find 293 you see why i like the keyword to dominator because it's giving me much more keyword but today because we need to use both of them i'm gonna copy the keywords that are from the keyword mesh titan basically paste them at the bottom of this list from there i'm gonna remove the duplicate or maybe i will duplicate this tab here okay i'm gonna remove this column i don't want to use them for now then i'm gonna remove the duplicate on excel it's very easy you select the column you go to data and there is this icon here to remove duplicates remove duplicate and it was able to find 41 keywords uh, duplicate and the remaining are 322 so we can see that both tools find keywords different keywords but this is good and this is very good for our exercise now what you have to do next is of course remove the keyword that are not really relevant for design for design for and first of all, we need to remove the shirt that are that are too good. For example, shirt for men, shirt for women, for boys, and so on. This is something that you have to remove. And of course, you have to remove everything that is branded. Okay, everything which is, uh, if I go 
if I check here, I can see everything that is, I don't know, friends are party shirt, for example, certainly a brand, I don't want to do that. And I'm pretty sure that when you look at these, the, the list of t-shirts, you're going to find a bunch of keywords that, are, that, we are, that you cannot use because they are brands and so on, like Marvel, like Disney and so on. Now, as you can see, we have keywords here, dogs, for example. You can see t-shirt for uncle, for aunt, okay? You can see t-shirt for uh, new dad, okay? This, uh, this is something, this is a keyword that people type directly on Amazon to find. So in your listing, you can type t-shirt for new dad, t-shirt for artist, this is another keyword, t-shirt for fisherman, for engineer, this is another keyword. Keeping that as rapidly and uh, actor, for example. Okay, t-shirt for actor. So I'm gonna uh, maybe check this one. If I type my main keyword here, t-shirt for actor. Okay, is it even a niche that is selling? Let's check. I can see below 500k, below 500k, below 500k. Okay, this one is still loading. Let's go down. Below 500k, below 500k, below 500k, above. So I can say by checking the two or the first two rows and even the, the third row that this is a niche that is selling. Okay. Now you can uh, go in there and dig down on this niche to find low competition keyword, to find low competition sub niche. Okay. If you want to see exactly how I did, how I do it. You can check the previous video. Thank you for your time.